Hello everyone, it's Xylo202 bringing you the next part of Let's Play Legend of Zelda Oracle of Seasons. We are now going to conquer the last bit of the first dungeon and fight the final boss. Alright, well since we beat the mini boss last time, there should be a portal over here that we can take to, uh, get to the boss. Die. I challenge you to a duel. You know, I always wonder how dead, undead skeletons drop hearts. They shouldn't have them anymore. Ah! I hate these jello things. They're in like every dungeon, too. Warp, 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 warp. Let's go this way. Haha! -ha. Can't stop, can't touch this. Um, now you need to figure out which one of these blocks moves so you can get in there. But I already know. It's this one. And I already know because I decided to play ahead and then record, so I actually know where I'm going. Um, if you guys prefer me wandering around aimlessly, desperately trying to figure out what to do, uh, tell me, and then I'll stop playing ahead, and I'll be totally clueless. Alright, uh, oh, totally forgot to mention, I just got the Amber Seed patch! Da 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 da! Don't, don't go back out the ladder. Um, the satchel allows us to carry seeds now, there's a bunch of different seeds in the game, but the ones we have right now are the Ember Seeds. And they will allow us to light things on fire, so I actually should swap those out. Put that on. First item swap of the game, yes. Oh, snap. Oh, dang, I hate this room! We're going this way. Taking the easy way out this time. Alright, come over here. Oh, wrong way. We have to get the, uh... There's a room of right here! That we've set on fire, and voila, this door opens. Kill them! Oh, I set the moblins on fire! And it worked! Moblins can be torched! Torch the moblins! Burn! Burn, moblins! Ha ha ha, I hate you! Um, I have no problem wasting all my ember seeds because, unlike a normal Legend of Zelda game, and partially why I hate th these uh, Game Boy adaptations, is the fact that dungeons really have nothing to do with the items you get inside. I mean, sure, they actually help you get to the boss, but the boss has nothing to do with them. Which is kind of sad. Like, uh, we got Ember Seeds and Bombs for this dungeon, and we will not need either of them to beat this boss. Okay. Okay, the one thing I hate more than those gel things are freaking Room Masters. Burn! Gosh, I hate these things. No, 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 no! Son of a Grrr. Die, Room Masters, die. Okay. Killed off the Room Masters. Let's go down here. And we got a ring. We'll be using those later in the game. Don't take the bottom route, it's a trap. Just a big old loop de loop and makes you waste time. See, told you. Room masters. We meet again. No, 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 no. No! No! No, you are not getting me from behind. No, die. Yes. Victory is mine. Alright, here we go. The boss room. Cha ching. And the boss is a giant dragon unicorn. I call it the Dranicorn. Um, this is really one of the dumbest bosses because it's super easy to beat. Um, I wonder what its weakness is. Maybe that glowing horn on the top of its head. Eh? Eh? It's glowing horn. Well, it was glowing. Glow! There we go. Shoots out fireballs. Yeah. That's its weakness. Just slash it. That's all you have to do. No joke. Just sit here and do this and you will kill him. Try to dodge his uh, fire a bit, but you actually do have kind of enough health to... Oh, wow. Okay, he hit me. Crap. Alright. Never mind. Uh, now I'm gonna have to start playing seriously. Hold on a second. Try not to think about what I'm saying now and just play because if I don't, I will die. There we go. Ha! I took off your horn! Take that! I'm gonna sell it on the black market next to all my ivories. I would say it, ivories. And I got a heart container! Yeah, I'm really lagging today. It's gonna sound like I'm lagging, but I'm not. I'm just forgetting to say things. Alright, so yeah, that's how you beat him. You beat him with the sword. Yeah, that's it. Real 
Strategic. Alright. Ooh, pretty room. I wonder what could be in here. And there it is. Our first essence of season out of the eight. You got the fertile soil! An essence of nature. Seeds scattered across bountiful lands are nourished in this infertile soil. I still don't get why there's eight. There's four seasons. So I guess there's two per season? Hmm? Just wanted to make this game longer and more of a hellhole. Fertile soil used ice beam! Oh no, he used explosion. And that's when the Leafs invaded. Or be the leaves invaded. It's me, the Meku Tree. Some of the fertile soil has come to me. Too, I already feel stronger. Oh, in my dreams, I saw the Temple of Seasons in a strange land. I do not know there I saw a precious item that will aid you, Zylo. That is all I can say now. <laughs> well, that was useful. Moving on. Oh, great. This is our first meeting with the stupid witch. Uh, she's gonna try to bump into you. You can dodge her and just ignore her, but if you bump into her sometimes, you get good stuff. I'm not going to bump into her, because I don't... You will lose stuff if you bump into her, but you also may, might be able to gain better stuff. I'm not choosing to do either of those. Uh, let's go to Impa's house. Okay, and we're back in Impa's house. Alright, let's check this out. Actually, we've never been in Impa's house, so... We're in Impa's house! Where can the Temple of Seasons be hidden, man? Does no one have a clue? Well, the Mako Tree does, but apparently you're not in the loop. I'm special. You're just a worthless bodyguard that failed. Wow. That was cold. I'm as cold as ice! Alright, let's go this way. Forgot, need to get this little bush. Ah! I, I probably should have... Uh, you can, I just planted a geisha seed in that fertile soil now by accident. Um, you can plant them in there and they will grow into trees and when the trees bloom they give you items. Just a little uh, fact there. Let's go down this way. Um, I don't really want to go around doing all the side quests. I mean I could but um, unless people watch this and say hey I want to see all the side quests um, I really don't feel like doing them. Um, on the other hand, though, I might just do one episode where I, later on where I have more actual items to work with and can go just get through, blow through most of it. I might just do an entire episode dedicated to side quests, and I just won't even go into a dungeon or fight a boss or nothing. Uh, the one thing I will do right now, though, is I will show off rings. So, now I've got, uh, I can't believe I only have 20 gems. Um, let's go over here. Get some rings. Okay. And, uh, yeah, talk to him. Do come in, I am Vasu, the jeweler, in this your first time? Let me explain jewelry. Rings made from mystical seeds have very mystical powers. If you wear one, its mystical powers will be passed on to you. But you must keep it in your ring box. The mystical power will gradually weaken it, and you won't be able to use it, understood? Um, yes? Oh, you don't have a ring box! I, I like you, so here, take this ring box. You got a level one ring box! It can hold one ring. Take this ring as a sign of our friendship. You got a ring, get it apprised. Later! Until you had a ring apprised and its power revealed, you cannot wear it. Let us apprise it! Okay, now you could apprise the ring he gave you, but that's just called the friendship ring, and all it does is, is means you talk to him. But you should apprise the ring that you got inside the temple, because it actually has abilities. Apprise this? Yes! Hmm, I see, I call this the friendship- Dang it! I apprised the wrong ring! Son of a- I'll apprise it for free this time, but after this I will be 20 rupees per ring. If you get two of the same ring, I'll buy one for 30 rupees. Now the list. Apprised rings go get added to the list. When you want a ring, move it from your list to your box. Talk to me to see your list. Let's take a peek at it now! Yep, there's the... And now I'm supposed to freaking add the friendship ring. Way to go. Fail. Rings do nothing unless worn. Do come in! Welcome to Vast Duelist! What can I do? Ugh, let's, I'm not gonna stop doing his voice. Apprise this ring. Here's my 20 rupees. 
Yeah, and you get the discovery ring, which you find inside the dungeon. Uh, you want to add that to your list, because it's the only good ring you should have by this point. And swap that out for... where is it? Uh, what the discovery ring does is it actually allows you to sense fertile ground nearby. Um, so basically, uh, you can equip rings by going to this menu and clicking on it. There we go. So that place where I planted that Gasha, Gasha seed, um, if you walk into an uh, area that has one of those patches on it, it, your screen will go boop, 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 beep, and then you'll know there's something in there. Let's go to the shop. You know, I can't buy anything in the shop. You can buy your shield there for 30. Dirt bags. You're ripping me off, man. You're ripping me off. Giving me into the man. Let's go this way. Um, I don't know exactly where I want to end this. Um, yeah, no idea. I actually feel kind of lost. Okay, no, no, I've seen those popping up today. No more. This is a Nintendo game. No Xbox stuff in here. Okay, fine, whatever. Do, do what you like. Throw up those achievements. I don't care. Yeah, so I guess from now on, there's going to be achievements in my videos. Why? I don't know. Alright, well... Let's go this way. What the? Oh yeah, I don't have that yet, do I? Wrong way! Totally wrong way! Wrong dungeon! I feel... Oh, wait, let's talk to this guy. Look, no matter how much I call her, my precious mittens won't come down if only I had a favorite treat. Fish. Mittens, meow. Meow. I could burn her down. Hold on a second. Ha <laughs> No. No, arsenic doesn't work. Or is it arsony? I don't know, what, what, what's it called when you burn houses down? Oh, it's winter time now in the village, so uh, snow piles up. And create this ledge to walk on. As the season summer creates vines, dries up rivers, spring makes flowers bloom, and winter creates snow barriers and freezes lakes. I'm trying to remember all the fall does absolutely nothing. All right, well, I guess I'll end this. Oh wait, no, we gotta talk to this guy. Wait, young traveler, I'm a wandering prophet, Sokra. Ah, I feel it, spring, summer, and autumn, winter. The four spirits are calling you, make no mistake, it's messing with my juju. The Temple of Seasons is still hidden in this world. If you can find the temple, then pay a visit to the spirits who live there. Surely they can help. Farewell. And that is why exactly why I love that dude. He knows absolutely everything to know in this game, and is just sleeping through it. He probably could save the world himself. And he's just gonna sit there. Alright, and you t burn down these trees with your new ember seeds, and... Do area! And back again. This is where I'll end the video, and next time we'll be exploring that area. So, bye!